So once you get Slack downloaded on your phone, um, yeah, so I have it right here. So once it's downloaded on your phone, now what I want you to do is go to um, settings in your phone, and then you're going to scroll down. And if you're on an iPhone, this is where you go, but notifications. And then again, you're going to scroll down and you're going to go to the S's looking for Slack. Okay. We're going to click on Slack and we're going to make sure that all of these are on allow notifications, uh, time sensitive notifications. We want the lock screen, the notification center, the banners, the banner style. We want to be persistent. We want to turn on sounds and badges, announce notifications, always on, and then um, lock screen appearance, show previews, always default. Notification grouping is going to be automatic. That's fine. And then you're going to go down to this button, uh, this link that says Slack notification settings. That's going to open up Slack itself and allow you to set the notification settings from within Slack. And so on mobile, notify me about all new messages you want that checked um notify me on mobile after one minute um as always even when i'm active that's what you want send notifications always even when i'm active and then the sound you can change to whatever sound you want um include a preview great notification schedule and then the rest of that um doesn't matter too much. Um, just make sure that thread notifications are on, announce huddle calls, and show in-app notifications. And that is how you can set up uh, notifications on your phone.